Hey, I should be working, but I'm playing with my coil winder. John Lauer recently recorded a couple of videos to show you how to clone a, a uh, workspace for your own motion control projects. Let's see if I can get it running in my coil winder in under 60 seconds. First thing you see is I'm logged into GitHub and I'm going to search for chili pepper. And I find a repository called Workspace Sample and I'm going to fork it. And I'm going to fork it into my repository here. So I have a, here it's now forked into GitHub. Then I'm going to go to Cloud9, click on my repositories, and scroll down and find my workspace sample, clone to edit. So now it's pulling over the, my GitHub repository into Cloud9. It's creating my container, and it's going to start executing it. First thing I want to do is hit Run JS, and I want to run that. So I hit Run. And then I hit the preview. I want to preview the, the running window. Come down here to the test URL with no SSL. Here's my widget. You can see that uh, my server showed up. Here's my uh, Gerbil board. Here's the serial port console. There, I'm doing that. Let me go ahead and spin up the Y axis. There you go. So now I have a cloned workspace running in Cloud9. If I hit uh, refresh, it's going to get pushed back over to my GitHub. Thank you, John, for recording this video. Now I'm going to start working on my uh, my um, my widget to actually control my coil winder.